breaks this tackle just. He has an average of 33.88 despite the two ducks in the previous matches. Oh, beautiful shot. One bounce over the fence. They had to win that match to stay alive in the tournament. Comes down the track, upishly played through the gap this time. Gets his first boundary. He likes going aggressive at the bowler, Kushal Burdil. Was played upishly on the rise, but through the gap. Oh, you can't bowl Kushal Burdil there. He is so good off his pads. He can smack good deliveries for sixes and this was a very, very poor delivery onto his pads and flicked it. Gurtel Mama, I love you. That's written on the chart paper. We all love him. Goes after it. Very, very high. Runs behind and easily held. Nepal losing their first wicket in Kushal Burtel. And Nepal lost their first wicket. The length was there to play this shot. Very, very high, running behind. The crowd silenced. And Nepal, after restring, restricting Netherlands for 120, they can look to finish this quickly. Oh, bowl him! Was a slow delivery, went for that expanded drive. The start that the Dutch team wanted, they have got that start. It's Vivian Kingma, two wickets in and over, dismissing two of the openers. But for Netherlands, they are in dire need of a wicket. A loser, walling outside the leg stump. Thank you very much, says Rohit Podel. And guess what? Gary Kirsten was doing the fielding <laughs> outside that boundary line. There is our production director, Yopesh Pradhan, has done a fine job. Nepalese batters, because the batting lineup is really deep. If they can apply pressure to Bender Merv earlier in the innings, as I was just telling, a photographic shot, the ball is sailed over the infield, clears the boundary comfortably into the crowds by Gulchinza. A very, very right tactic to do. Well, that's a maximum result with the brute force and calculated risk. Look at it, Gulchan just slog sweep the ball over the midwicket region, sending it soaring into the crowd. That's a colossal six kid, and look at that shot. Just coming down the track to the pitch of the ball. He gets a proper grip of the pitch going forward to that follow through after delivering the ball. This time just played softly. The offside reason in the back foot. This is what they, they are doing at the moment. They are not. So 52 runs partnership of 43 deliveries between Rohit Kumar, Podal and Gulchanja. Headache for... Netherlands Bender Merv continuing with his second, gone for five, gone for nine in his very first Bender over. A easily played shot, misfailed the last thing that Netherlands would want. It looks like from the body language of the players, they have given up on the game. It's been easy pickings. The misfail from Levitt, would you believe it? A wicket is what Netherlands need. Cut in the gap. Plenty of work to do there for Levitt and this time he compensates for that. They only have 32 runs to defend and Nepal looks well on top of them. Up and over. Levitt can do nothing at this occasion. And another boundary for Nepal, this time off the bat of Rohit Podil. The luck is going into their favour as well. Look at that slap shot, just clears the infield, races towards the boundary. Come to this ground and enjoy your team play. Oh, that's, that's been pulled. One bounce and over the rope. Struggled in all departments today. Couldn't build up those important partnerships. Levit after Leviton. So 14 runs required. Nepal three hits away from another victory. Consecutive victories. And he had to settle for single. So just 13 runs needed. Just formality in this game. Rohit cuts, the ball's racing towards the boundary, Filter couldn't stop it, four runs. Things are happening, the batting looks fairly easy with the way these two batters are batting. A bit on a tad, shorter shot, cuts it really well between those two fielders and the fielders in the boundary line could just watch it sail over the boundary for four. And this is a massive partnership for Nepal. Oh, bowl him. 
he was looking to play that shot premeditated Aryan Dutt realized and kept the ball really straight Gulshan again trying to improvise on his shot missed it completely hit the leg stump the wicket perishes Aryan Dutt is being rewarded for very well bowled spell a huge roar from the crowd applauding the great effort from Gulchenza goes for 38 they know that Nepal only one hit away only four runs required and they'll also be excited for Rohit Powdell the captain was batting at 46 now will he finish this off in style what a catch brilliantly held by Cruz and again against the run of play Rohit Powdell has been dismissed for 46 the crowd stunned from course was magnificent look at that jumping diving stretching the arm getting that ball Rohit Powdell was just trying to chip that ball cross the infield goes for 46 Nepal just four runs away from their victory just one run shy of their second victory in the tournament has been a wonderful performance from the home side Taps it down for a single. That's a victory for Nepal. Direct hit would have made the difference probably, but not to be. And Nepal completing this victory against a strong Netherlands side in style. Nepal have gone on to win this match by six wickets. Clapping and cheering for Team Nepal. As you can see, cameras are out. Witnessing and recording, capturing the moment. Nepal finally being able to defeat the mighty Netherlands, collect those two important points. They will be sitting comfortably and enjoying the game tomorrow. Well done, Team Nepal.